Zach Ryan, final play of the game, throws it into the end zone. And intercepted by the Buckeyes, Amir Reed. And that's the end of the game. Ohio State 56, Nebraska 14. Right now, let's get you back to Los Angeles for more college football. Here we go. Mike Riley probably looking at his last walk off this field here in Lincoln. The season ends at four and eight for Nebraska. Nebraska historically uh, belongs in the upper echelon of, of college football. Hasn't really been accomplishing uh, things to that degree for a while. Uh, not Certainly not to the degree that the people in Nebraska and the people of the university wanted to. I'm just excited to start, to start the, the process of getting Nebraska uh, back where it belongs, making it competitive and, and trying to compete for championships. But when I sit in, the, in, the, in my office with recruits uh, in this first recruiting cycle, the, the parents all remember Nebraska as Nebraska. Uh, a lot of the kids don't remember that. Um, it's our job to change that. It's our job to make sure that the, the new generation remembers Nebraska uh, for what it is and what it should be. And, and we're in the process of making sure that uh, the kids that we're going to recruit going forward uh, see Nebraska as one of the top programs in the country. See Nebraska as one of the top programs in the country. But listen, Coach Osborne had the formula Nebraska figured out. Uh, some of the things that he did to make the program arguably the best in the country can still work today. Nebraska's just gone away from it. And we're going to adopt a lot of those things again and um, do it in a modern way, a way that uh, recruits and kids are going to want to be a part of.
into the same type of program and develop them too. And, and by the time they were sophomores, juniors, juniors and seniors, they were contributing. Um, the program used to reflect the people of the state. Nebraska's best asset is its people. It has unbelievable people that are hard-working, blue-collar people that are going to care about each other. Um, that's what we're trying to get back to in our program, and, and that's the way that we're going to build it to try to make it uh, have sustained success.